How long can you keep fresh water in the RV tank? One of the things I love most about my RV is having water everywhere we go. We don't always have to rely on campgrounds to hook up for fresh water. It's very helpful to be off the grid for days and have everything we basically need. If you are relatively new to RVing, then you might have some questions about the RV's water system. For instance, the RV water system works differently from the water system we have at home. The RV has three water tanks, each having different purposes. The fresh water tank stores water for drinking, cooking, and bathing. The gray water tank is used to store wastewater from the sink and shower. And lastly, the black water tank which is used to hold wastewater from the toilet. The fresh water tank requires the least amount of maintenance, making it easy to neglect or overlook its cleanliness. Which leads us to the question how long can we keep fresh water in the RV before it turns bad? How long can I keep fresh water in the holding tank? The fresh water tank holds water that will be used for all your water needs inside the RV. Regardless if it's for drinking or cooking or bathing, the water will all come from the same tank. For safe drinking water, it's suggested to not keep the water for more than two weeks, especially if the RV is not in use. If you are just using the water for bathing, cleaning, and washing utensils, then you may keep the water longer. One thing you have to consider though is how clean the tank is when you started filling it with water. If it hasn't been sanitized beforehand, then the water may turn bad faster than usual. If the water tank is not sealed properly, the quality of the water may be affected. And if the weather is hot, bacteria is most likely to grow. I recommend bringing your own drinking water separately, leaving the water in the tank for all other purposes. What do I do if there is algae in my RV fresh water tank? An obvious sign that there's algae in the tank is when you see green patches or the water starts tasting funny. But don't wait for those signs because algae can live in the water even before you notice. You don't have to worry though because getting rid of algae is easy. You can also take additional steps to prevent it from growing again. The key here is to disinfect the tanks, then you'll be sure to be algae free. What you'll need Long handled brush or soft sponge, 3 quarters cup of bleach, 15 gallons of water, more water for flushing. How to clean your tank 1. Remove algae patches by using a long handled brush or soft sponge. Do not use abrasive materials such as steel brushes to avoid scratching the tank's interior. 2. Dilute the bleach in the water. Pour it inside the tank. 3. Leave for at least 2 hours, then flush it out using the RV's water lines such as kitchen faucets and showers. 4. To remove the bleach, fill tank with clean water and flush again. Repeat until the smell of bleach has disappeared. To prevent algae from growing again, empty water tanks completely after each trip. Repeat steps 2 to 4 before refilling the tanks. You may use a smaller amount of bleach since you've already sanitized the tanks before your trip. Use 1 quarter cup of bleach for every 15 gallons of water instead of 3 quarters cups of bleach. It's as easy as that and you're all set for your next trip. Does sanitizing my RV water tank often help? Remember that even a little bit of moisture is still enough for algae to grow. If you leave it like that for a long time, your tank's interior will be full of algae in no time. Some people who use separate containers for drinking water don't give this much thought. 
I still suggest sanitizing your water tanks regularly because you will be using the water for other important purposes such as washing dishes or bathing. I find it important to sanitize on a regular basis. Some RVers say you should sanitize at least twice a year. But if the water starts tasting funny before your scheduled cleaning, you may need to do it more often. It's important not to overlook this as it directly affects the health of you and your family. Why should I clean my RV water tank with bleach? Bleach is excellent in removing algae and moss. It contains sodium hypochlorite which breaks down organisms that are difficult to remove. Because of that, bleach is highly recommended in cleaning RV water tanks, hoses, and lines. Some skip sanitizing their fresh water tanks often because they have a different source for drinking water. No matter how you intend to use your fresh water tank, you now know why it's important to sanitize regularly. The steps are easy and the materials are affordable and easy to find. Do this at least twice a year and you're all set.